Thank you so much for joining me as Game Age. We're back in Islands, which is also Wildlands. Some people call it that, but yes, we've actually downloaded a new game setting in here, which is called Buccaneer Bay. You can do this from their actual website. You can download it right through your Steam, and it just goes directly to the game. It's pretty cool. And yes, we have a lot to try out here and see what this place looks like. This is all you can create in, in I guess, Islands. In, I'm going to call it Islands. Some people call it Wildlands. It could, depends what you want to. Uh, powder Keg. Yeah, I'll pick that shit up. Why not? I have no idea what I'm going to do with that. Uh, it's, it's obviously I can light this shit up, I guess. Is that what it is? Can we, can we light this shit up? Let's see if we can place this over here and make an explosion. Can I ignite? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Shit. Holy crap. Well, that was a crater. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, that that is that is really freaking awesome. All right, there's actually one there too. There's powder kegs in here. That's really nice. And again, this is all created by the actual uh, staff over there, and they're showing you what you can build inside this game. There's this awesome, awesome ship here. That is nice over there too. This is a nice tall ship. You can actually also use the cannons here, which we'll actually we'll grab in here. Oops, and we'll grab ourselves some cannonballs. And again, this can be played for multiplayer too purposes. You can actually build on here. You can still craft and do exactly what you were doing before, but you have a little bit of stuff you can download and enjoy yourself. I just do reload here and grab this stuff in here. And you can actually... Oh, there's a ship over there. Let's, let's down the ship. Oh, shit. Anyways, yeah, we can actually hit up anything we want to hit. Uh, I wonder if I could aim for this one. Let's do this. Oh, no, no. Go back in. Reload. Let's drop this here. There we go. Let's uh, aim for this. Let's see how much damage this actually does. Damn. All right. So we actually have cannons. We have other things. Uh, I'll throw this. I don't know if there's... Can we go down below? I don't know if we can go down below. What is this? Anchor. Did the anchor just go in the water? Really? I got to see that. Like, visually. I can't see it when I'm dropping it. Oh, there it is. I can see it now. Just a tiny bit. I want to see it drop or not. No, I want to see the anchor. Anchor. Bring it to the anchor. Oh, yeah. Okay. I see it's drag. Okay. It's not like it's smooth or anything. It's direct, but it's still quite amazing. I've never seen a game be able to do that. Uh, not this style of game, at least. It's pretty, really cool. Wooden barrels. Again, there's some wooden barrels. Anyways, you can actually take hold of the ship here. I don't think there's anything below, but you can actually take hold of it. Uh, arms chair. I guess you can be captain if you want to. And take control of your vessel. This is very, very nice. Oh my god. I'm liking this a lot. Now, can you imagine you actually having this a whole bunch of friends here? You got, a, you got on top of here and you start shooting each other. It's fun that they actually made this portion of it. So this way you can actually kind of play the game and enjoy it. I think that's pretty darn cool. So you can actually see a whole bunch. We're going to explore this whole island that they created. And I think you can actually sail out and find other islands. If I'm not mistaken, the sails just switch up. It got faster as we're pulling back. Oh, that's really nice. That's very nice. Oh, I'm liking that a lot. That is sweet. All right, we're going to kind of sail around here and just double check to see this island. It looks really smooth. Okay, we can go really fast by just pressing a little more. And there we go. Now we got some speed on this, baby. It's not so slow. Pretty darn cool. What do you guys think about this? This is pretty darn nice. Extras. Uh, I'm going to bring you guys a couple more of these game modes that they're going to be releasing on December 6th. And again, the link will be in the description field. Um, I did find there's some pay, uh, paid stuff on the actual game itself, which is kind of what kind of like threw me off a little bit. But I think it's just for custom emotes and uh, other things you want to do. So those are small things. Not game breaking or not game, uh, not game forcing you to actually do it. But that's pretty darn nice. Oh, look at that. I wonder if I could sink this son of a bitch. I wonder how realistic this would be. All right, let's actually bring this. There's actually a cannon right over there. I wonder if I can... Uh, it's going to be far away. I'm not going to see that properly. Can I back her up? Beep, beep. That is really nice. Oh, my God. There's actually some ruins, too. I can see a bunch of ruins in the middle. Or is that a building? I know that's actually a nice big castle up there. Or at least a pirate cove. We're going to move our ship to the other ship over there that was destroyed. A wreck. 
Let's see if we can ram this son of a bitch. But really cool, you can actually still craft in this game. So if you didn't see the first episode, I did show you guys the crafting portion of it and what you can actually do. All the materials you can pick up off of this. You can do this right now in the same thing in this island here. You can still build it. You can actually still, well, there's there's probably still some animals on here. We'll have to find that out very shortly. I did a, just test it out to see if I like this. And it only took a bit, a few minutes and then I, I jumped back in. I didn't go onto the island because I didn't want to just, you know, ruin it for us. It's kind of like a, something I like to do all together. Let's make that a little faster. And lower sales, you can just press S. Oh, okay, this goes up and down. Gotcha. Full sales is W. Gotcha. So S and W, up and down. All right, cool. Ramming this ship. Let's see what happens. Oh. Is it jammed? Ah, damn. I think I jammed the son of a bitch. Yeah, I jammed it. All right. Good job, Captain. Uh, thank you. Ow, I guess sea urchin there. I just hit that up. Let's see if we can actually sink these sons of bitches. Um, I wonder if I put a power keg on that son of a bitch. Maybe I'll make some, give me some room. I really want to test out what we can do in this game. Uh, did I just drop it or did I just grab it? I did grab it. Okay, so it's number four. Gotcha. Quick climb up here. The, the virtual ladder. Awesome. There we go. Let's use a power keg here. Oh, shit, shit, shit. <laughs> Look at the ripple. That That is pretty nasty fun. Oh, that was pretty cool. All right, let's see if we can actually take this baby out here. All right, right click. Again, I keep on messing up with that. Reload. Let's grab some... Psst, come on, baby. I don't think I did anything. Hmm. Might have to bring the other one around. I think that's what we're going to have to do here is bring the other one around for us to see. All right, let's grab this here and drop that baby up here. We can actually really turn this thing around, can we? Well, wow. got a pretty good line of sight if we want to. Uh, that's that's jammed in. They're kind of jammed in. It's okay. It's my fault. I went to take it around. Oh, don't fall in there. Damn. <laughs> There's so much you can actually do in this. We're going to check out the other vessel here, too. I do like this. Oh, look at the fog. This is a weather system they're talking about the kind of, that actually is in a game. I do like the torches, too. There are there. And you can actually, like I mentioned, pick up all the stuff you want. Uh, as you're walking around here, you can pick up uh, sticks and start your crafting. Uh, you do start off also with a gun here, which is your musket. And you also have a sword. So you can have a battles together. Ha! That is really sweet. And of course, our musket. Let's reload this baby. Some other vessels here that's down. How much damage does this do? I don't know. Just a little shot. I guess we could finally take away to the animals if we want to. They've been bothering us kind of a bit. Those are bigger cannons in there, aren't they? They look bigger. Are they bigger? Cannonballs. We have lots of cannonballs. Oh, look at that. Sharks. Shite. Alright, be careful in the water. I did not realize there were sharks in this game. Can I actually shoot them? Holy crap. It's hitting them. I can actually see the damage on them. I don't know if that's actually doing anything. Nah, it's not doing anything to them. Maybe it's because he's inside the water. Oh, no. That, that was good. I saw the meat just fall down there. <laughs> Big Betty. Oh, Big Betty. Bam, ba -lam. Oh, Black Betty. All right. Let's see if we can aim for that shark. Wow. Uh, that went friggin' far away. All right. Let's aim a little lower this time. Obviously, Big Betty is uh, a little more bang for your buck. Oh, that's too far away. It's all good. It's all good. We So you can actually damage at least the sharks and take care of that. That's a pretty nice. Let's go through here. And I always forget. To, it's clicking to the right. I'm sure you can change that up. Oh, shit. There's spikes on the side. Oh, make sure you can't board. Nice. Is the anchor up, matey? Anchor level. Lever. Sounds like I went in. All right. There you go. 
This this is very, very nice. Oh, look at the shark. Oh, nice. Just sit right back in here, too. All right, let's get around here and see if we can actually take this baby down. Oh, she is. Look at the amount of friggin' cannons on this one. That is insane. Oh, my God. That's so sick. Oh, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. All right. So there's a lot we can actually do. We can actually have a lot of fun multiplayer. And a lot of people are going to, I guess, well, a little bit of extra games inside this crafting game, which, you know, sometimes you want to change it up a bit. That is pretty nice. Now, I'm hoping there's no sharks around here. We'll uh, go around onto this side here. We're just going to leave it in the middle of water. I want to see if what happens. Can we actually sink this or just levels itself on top of water? That's what the question is for me. I'm going to leave it in deeper water. Right here. I'll back her up just a tiny bit. I want to build a shooter. Let's just back her up. There is a shark right there. We're going to have to swim this. There. All right, let's put the anchor down. Uh, yeah, let's put the anchor down. I shouldn't affect it. That shark wants a little piece of game edge. I can feel it. Is that on a reef? No, it's not. All right, cool. Let's make our way over here. Let's test this baby out. We're going to go check up up there, too. Don't worry. We'll check it all out. And again, you can download this for free. It is on their store. You just have to kind of go to their website, Bohemian's website, and actually just not, actually click on the one you want to download and then link it with, I did it with Google Plus or whatever you want to do with Steam, and then you can actually just do it. You can just uh, download it when you start the game up or actually you didn't even start the game up i was in the game when i actually linked them both together it started downloading them right away so very easy oh, oh it went black okay does this sink does this sink can we sink this baby i don't know maybe not maybe she's unsinkable oh no she's sinking oh she's going down She's taking on water. Oh my. Can she go all the way down? Oh, she's listening. Oh, she's listening. Oh. Nice. It got caught in a coral, I think. Just a tiny bit. Not sure if we can do very much more to this. But it's going to be in time. I don't know. Maybe it doesn't allow you to destroy it completely. Is that possible? Then again, the other one over there is pretty much destroyed. I do like this weather effect. Very nice. Loud. All right. That's pretty cool. All right. Can we take down at least a sail here? Let's just test it out one more time. You guys know how it is. We, we want to test this shit out. Let's go for the sail. Right there. Come on. Take it out. Oh, it does. Oh. <laughs> Okay, so we can actually take this one out. This, this is actually fully, oops, fully breakable. So we can actually build these. You can also build your own if you want to inside the game. You don't have to be playing this mode. You play the mode I played on the first episode. Come on, baby. Can we do it? Can we bring this thing down? <laughs> I see it destroying. I wish you could put more in one cannonball, or at least, well, it makes no sense, yeah. If you want to play fair. The guy just be shooting at you crazy, crazy amounts. There we go. Right through that one. Holy shit. There's nothing left of that ship. All right, so it has its own, it looks like it's sunk itself, which is really nice. I do appreciate that portion of it. All right, that looks like that ship is no longer good. Too bad it was actually beautiful. Good job, Game Edge, for ruining that. <laughs> so we can use this axe, this sword here, sorry. And uh, we can actually take apart everything we want to. And just have to pick up all the sticks you want to. And again, the crafting menu is right here. So you can actually craft everything you want to in this game. Here you got power kegs, gunpowder. I'm not sure if this is specialty just for the actual game. Or is it, you know, like, is there a possibility that this is actually made for uh, throughout the whole thing? I don't know if you can craft powder kegs or if that's just standard. But that's very cool. We're going to go check out this wonderful, wonderful, I guess, pirate cove. A pirate base. What is that stuff? It's like luminescent glowing mushrooms. That can't be good. That can't be good for us. 
And we do have a sword too, so at least we'll protect ourselves and a musket. Uh, those darn lep. I don't know, those are. Okay, good. I thought it was a tiger. I thought it was a tiger. All right, here we are inside the actual base itself. There's a. Well, what's that? What's, what's that? What's this called? Wooden cabinet. Okay. You can take everything you want here, too. They could do treasures, Egyptian vase, golden. Open this up if you want to. You can store all your inventory if you want to in here. I'm not sure what the rationale will be for this, but you know, I guess you can have treasure and certain things to steal from the other people. You can make your own games with this, of course, or you can play by yourself too and just enjoy doing your own uh, base like this uh, on the actual island, or get at least some. So, wow, this is pretty high up. At least get some ideas too would be pretty nice. Oh shit! Okay, didn't hurt myself. Nice. We have a cannon over here too. What's this cannon called? Small bumblebee cannon. See bumblebee. Bumblebee. All right, let's see. Can I take out the trees? Fire! Oh, shit, it can. Uh, too bad there's no animals. I don't see any animals around that area or else I'd have tried it out on the actual predators and stuff, but I do not see anything. It's okay. We'll head to and check out what else they have here. That is very nice. Is there a basement to this place? There is no basement. But I guess you can build your own, too. Just start digging up here and getting what you need. Very nice, very nice. What is this, number one? Uh, sorry, number nine. What does that say? Ship, wind, in indicator, pristine. Oh, okay. I guess you can find out your wind by actually doing this. Oh, don't tell me the wind It's actually... Yes, it does, look. The wind's blowing in the proper direction. Holy shit. Okay, that's pretty damn impressive. That is pretty darn impressive. Look at this. Oh man, what a, you can build all this stuff with this game. Okay, that kind of this actually, I was on a, I don't know border there before, but now I'm kind of like liking what I'm seeing here. I really do. I think this is actually pretty darn cool, especially you got. I'm like, I mean, pick up everything you see. Uh, trees can be knocked down. Anything you think of. And right click. Can I take these guys out? Oh man, they're fast. They don't have a gun now, don't they? Oh, we got it. We got a predator. Oh. Oh, he became meat. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. Yeah, pick up the hide too. Leopard. Okay, so leopards. Gotcha. Let's take out our sword. We'll mess around with this too and see if we can do uh, how much damage this does to the actual leopards uh, you know, with combat. What is this? Is this more? There's more ships on this side. Holy crap. All right, that's pretty cool. That is pretty darn cool. What is that on this side? There's another port. I guess you can each defend your side or go for a king of the hill style. There is another ship vessel over there. Same kind of port we had on that side. And the same thing for this one, too, where you can actually defend yourself. I wonder if there's like two, more than two or three. Maybe there's three of them. I don't know. Maybe there's one room for one more on that side. It's very possible. That is very nice. This is the same kind of vessel. Oh, look at that. Got propellers. I didn't realize that. This one's different. I mean, the other one looked really badass, I have to say, though. This one is, is nice, but it's not badass. Very sweet. Let's swim up to it. Let's use a ladder. Got a little rugs and stuff. All right. Go and loot up the area if you want to. Use the cannons here. Destroy other people's bases. Or your own if you, you know, tend to really like to do that. I'd like to see things break. Great shot, Game Edge. How about you aim a little bit higher? Just a tiny bit. We'll put some more in here. That was like lackluster ending, huh? Come on, right there. Yeah, it goes right through. So, I mean, it doesn't collapse the whole building, but it does cause some damage. Look at this one. It's got all the uh, antiques, vases, everything on here. Persian rug. This thing must be super quick with all these propellers and stuff. Just sit right back. Look at the sucker. Look how beautiful this is. 
Oh my. I think I'm liking what I'm seeing here. Okay, I, I would like to see multiplayer with this. This would be kind of fun to kind of mess around with. Because you have all these other game modes, not only in survival, but all these other game modes, it really does change up what you're going to be spending your money on and knowing that you can do multiple things and actually have a whole bunch of fun. Now, the editor is also available for you to create if you want to. So that is something. If you prefer to do it yourself. Oh. Yeah, let's get it. Let's let's do this but one more time. One more time. So there's a lot to do. Let's get the big Betty. Let's see what she can do. This one's a port. Take advantage of it. You know, it's our own flags. <laughs> Took out the ladder. Well, good luck getting on your ship now. It's getting dark. <laughs> what if you could take away the uh, night, the day cycle a lot? I didn't see that in the options. Oh yeah, that's that's gonna sink it. One more shot. What if it's gonna start listening this way? This way it should be. It's sinking all the way down. Right down to the bottom. So if we were in deeper water, this would have sunk all the way through and now it's gone. That is really, really awesome. All right, guys. So if you guys like this, you want to see more game modes, get in there and get in Confield Site Game. If you want to see what else this game has to offer, get available on December 6th on Steam Store. Anyways, just grab that if you want to. But thank you so much, guys, for being here. I really do appreciate it. Uh, this is really cool. Very dark now, but very cool. So thank you so much. Again, if you guys like this, hit that like button. This is the Edge from Game Edge, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Arr!